Westmoreland Street officially opened in July 2015 and is accommodating services for urology patients and thoracic patients. This site was formerly known as the Heart Hospital. All the clinical teams, admin and management teams are based within this building. It means that the different departments can work in a much more integrated fashion. For many patients, an interaction in a centre like this with a, a urology condition um, will come with that a sense of anxiety. One of the things that we can deliver through the team approach is working with patients to allay that anxiety and give them a sense of confidence. The sort of patients that I see, their quality of life is affected by incontinence. This impacts on their working life, on their family life, on their social life. Lee is exactly one of those patients. My consultant in Basildon referred me to Ms Paxad because she was a top specialist in the country. Put my mind at ease straight away because I knew I was seeing someone at the top of their game. So what I'm going to do is pop this needle in so it's sitting in the S3 nerve root. Can you see those blue electrodes? Those are the bits that we stimulate with an electric current to try and get your bladder to start working again. The aim is that his bladder will regain control and Lee will regain control of his life. We've got 27 consultants in total and between us we cover five subspecialties. My job is in Stones and Urology and we have quite a small unit ourselves. The staff are specialist trained to a very high level. We know a lot of our patients very well, so I think we're able to humanise the, the surgical procedures and put people at their ease and make them feel, feel calm and like they're in, in safe hands. I've been in here now for two weeks. The nursing staff, to my mind, are second to none. When I've been upset, the nursing and care staff here spend time with me, make sure that I'm OK, reassure me that you know things are going to improve. That's probably more important than anything else. The imaging department at UCLH and here at Westmoreland Street is a really well-resourced um, department to have some of the best imaging resources in the world for the investigation of urological disease. One of the nice things about coming to Westmoreland Street as a patient is that almost everything the patient needs is all within the same building. Patients will typically go from clinic straight round to have x-rays or ultrasound perhaps. It's actually really quite straightforward for the patient. Here in urology we're innovative and we've got great examples in robotic surgery and focal surgery for prostate cancer that allow us to tailor the ideal treatment to the needs of an individual patient. Thoracic surgery is surgery of the chest. We run a service for our patients where we do most of the work with them at their local hospital. When their surgery is over and they've been operated on here, once again we visit them back at their local hospital and that provides a seamless service locally for our patients. A lot of the surgery we do in the chest now we do by keyhole surgery. So the next step is something that we've been given the opportunity to do here uh, with our Da Vinci robot. The instrumentation mimics the movements of your hands and we feel that that's a much safer way to do advanced surgery in the chest. So that means a patient doesn't stay in the hospital a week, they can go home usually the following day. We have our specialist areas of interest but then we come together as a larger team. I think there is that common sense of pride, pride in delivering a service, making it better, in looking after patients. It pervades the whole hospital. 